Hey there, everybody. How are you? I am Michelle Ray, and welcome back to my channel, The Attic Addicts. It has been a little bit of a hot minute since I have been doing a video for you guys, but I'm back. I'm obviously not in my attic. It was a little cold in my attic, so um, we're here in the living room with Luna, and I have something so exciting for you guys today. All right, so I don't know how many of you guys have heard of Thread Up. Well, Thread Up is a online store where you can send some of your items in. It's like a consignment, right? Sort of like, kind of like Poshmark, sort of. But they offer this thing called the Rescue Box. <laughs> and I've done one of these before. I did actually film it, but I, I didn't end up um, putting it up. One thing led to another, but um, <clears throat> excuse me. Anyway, I had such a good time doing the first box and checking it out that I thought I was going to do one for you and this time I really post it. So for those of you who don't know, let me show you what I, what I bought. Oh, I don't know even know if I can lift it. Oh my God. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> this is the thread up mystery box with 50 pounds of women's clothing in it. It says, hooray, your goodies are here. And I have been so excited to film this for you guys. So let's jump into it and let's see what's in here. Um, I have been thrifting for about a year. Ah! <laughs> and I am learning. I am predominantly on Poshmark and I'm a part-time reseller. This is so big and heavy. And I am just learning. I am not perfect. I, oh, I make mistakes all the time, but I love it. I love uh, recycling clothing and yeah, it just brings me a lot of joy. Anyways, let's just get into this. So I'm going to open it. I just have to, hold on, let's see, let's see what's in here. Oh my gosh. Last time my box was really, really awesome, except the only complaint was all the sizes were very small. So with this box, it's all different sizes, women's clothing, that's it. Big surprise. Okay. They have two ones that you can buy. They have boxes with, I think, intimates and jammies. So, all right, let's see. Okay, so it says... 100%. Ooh, I see something red. 100% thrifted. Yes. Okay. Let's see what's in here. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so let's open. Oh boy. <laughs> All right, let's see here. I have to get myself in a good spot with this box. This is bigger than me. <laughs> Holy cow. Okay, let's pick up something red. Ooh. Red shorts, okay, these are super fun. I like shorts because it is getting warm here and perfect timing. Oh, Land's End, size six petite. I like those, Luna. Luna, these are my clothes, I'm sorry, baby, here. I love these, these are great. Okay, number one's super practical. Let's see. Something pink and sparkly. What is that? Joyce Leslie. It looks like a little dress. Ooh, it looks like it's got an interesting shape to it. Hmm. It's pink and kind of shiny. All right. Eh, not so sure about that one. Let's see. What's next? Oh, now this is, okay. So this print never goes out of style. Animal prints never really go out of style. You could take something like this and throw a jean jacket over it and wear it with some leggings, or you could just wear it with jeans and high heel boots. This is from Ink. This is really nice. It's a petite large. So that's good. That's a pretty good, a pretty good size. <clears throat> Oh, I see stars. I love stars. I see stars. Stars. Okay. What is this? You see the stars? Oh, 
Oh, it's a little wrap dress by Likely. Hmm, that's cool. It's like little shorts and then it ties in the front. One of the things I really liked about my last box from ThreadUp was I felt like I definitely got some items that I wouldn't have normally purchased. I, I wouldn't have picked them out for my closet. And some of them are more current styles, so I actually learned something from it. And I, I felt like overall that the box of clothing that I received from ThreadUp actually added to my inventory and gave me a little bit more of a younger style. Um, so that part I really like too. Um, so this is cute, that's a star. I'll have to try that on and see how it looks. Ooh, denim! Denim is one of my favorite things to sell. I love it. Here's some Gap True Skinnies, 27 regular. They look like they're in really good shape. I love denim, 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 denim. Men wear denim, women wear denim, kids wear denim, everybody wears denim, pretty much. It's always a good thing to invest in and to resell. Ooh, black pants for work, we love that. Oh, Garnet Hill. Okay, I love Garnet Hill. If you don't know Gar Garnet Hill, oh, they make such beautiful, beautiful things. These are some great pants. They're so cute, they have a little, um, I guess it's a cuff at the bottom. Oh, they're great. And they look like a good size too. Size eight. I am so impressed with the sizes so far, you guys. These are great. And these are perfect for work. A nice black pair of trousers, but these are cool. They have a cuff. Okay. I see something velvet. Okay. Velvet. Velvet. Oh, this is from The Gap. It looks like it's a black velvet tank top. This is an extra small. I actually like it for a camisole. It'd be cute. It's like a velvety texture. That's practical. Oh, pants, more pants, more pants. Oh, these look like a great size too. Bean, LL Bean, wow. I love L.L. Bean. I grew up in Michigan, so we we're, we liked L.L. Bean and Eddie Bauer and all that kind of stuff growing up. These are really nice pants, men's uh, women's pants, excuse me, size 16. Straight leg. I feel like they're cotton, comfy. All right, other than that pink dress, that sparkly whatever that thing was, a disco ball dress, <clears throat> I'm pretty happy so far. Okay, sweaters, sweaters, let's see. Oh, it's a cowl neck sweater. Look at that big, long cowl neck sweater. Look, again, looks like a good size. Good job, thread up. Good job listening to all of us say the sizes are too small. I may have just um, jinxed myself. Let's see. What's this? Vero Moda. I don't know what it is, but it's super soft. I love it. It's got a nice texture to the material, like an oatmeal color. I'll take that. Oh my gosh, you guys are so much in this, in this box. You wanna see? Hang on, look. Look at all the stuff in this box. It's enormous. Okay. I hope you still like me after this 45 minute video. <laughs> Okay, I'll make it fast, let's go. Oh, something pink. This looks like a long sleeved, very nice. Calvin Klein. Oh, it's got little open shoulders on it. Looks like it's in pretty good condition. No stains. It's got the nice little Calvin Klein thing over here. Super cute. Ooh, something big and white. And looks, what's this? Oh. <gasps> Brand new with tags, $595. It's a theory size two, absolutely gorgeous white skirt, you guys. Oh, OMG. 
G. This is so beautiful. It's an ivory. I mean, it's a size two, but it's, 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 it's beautiful and it has tags. Someone is going to love this. Love this. Oh my gosh, this is really great. Oh, I see rubber pants. The Loft. We like that. We like that brand, The Loft. These are cute. They are the um, faux leather pants, and they're like nice inside. They're like a nice and little bit soft, size large. Oh my gosh. I already can't wait to get some of this stuff up. <laughs> And what's this? This is Sanctuary, a long sleeve blouse with polka dots. Again, polka dots never go out of style. And yeah, it just looks like a nice little, little blouse. Oh my God, something sparkly. Ah! Are you ready for this one? Oh my gosh, what is it? It's making me itch. Is making me itch. Oh my goodness, it's a sweater and it has some kind of like little buttons on it that look like they're some sort of bedazzled. Does this have a tag on it? Wow, it looks like garland that somebody made a sweater out of garland. It feels really like no nails on a chalkboard. No, me, no, likey that one. Okay, let's keep going. Ooh, this is Christopher Banks Petites. Oh, that's a cute little red top. Keep forgetting you guys are like a little bit lower, sorry. I wanna fly through this so you, so you start. Oh. What is that? Oh, okay. I thought it was something else. See, there's still nice David Kahn. David Kahn. Jeans, David Kahn. Pants, brown pants. I don't know much about this brand, but that's another reason why I really like getting this thread up box is because last time I learned about some new designers that I had never heard of. So I got to look them up. I love to do research on everything. I love it, love it, love it. Here's a skirt from the loft size medium. Nice gray, cute mini skirt. The sweater fabric. Wow, I have to say, I think so far, so good. So for instance, this little loft skirt, I would probably list it for somewhere maybe around, I don't know, maybe 22, 24, 22, somewhere around there. I'll mention to you guys what I think I might price some things at so it gives you kind of an idea of where we're at. Old Navy. This is a, a tank top with little dingleberries at the bottom. No, it's not. <laughs> I call those dingleberries, though. See what I mean? Those little dingle things. Eh, well, maybe. Oh, man. This is cute. Size four and tailor. Again, I, I do like polka dots. And tailor little top. Size is this one. Is this a small? Yeah, this is a small. I like the pat. I like the color, though. And I like the pattern. It's got polka dots and navy on it. Oops. Ooh, this one looks very paisley. So I paid $140 for this box. And that was including shipping. It got here in about a week. I was actually very surprised. I don't know what this is, but I'm not sure how I feel about it. What the heck? Mm. It's like they they it's like they ran out of fabric on one side and they were like screw it. We're just going to make it black on the other. But it's good. We're doing well. Ooh. Cashmere? Is it cashmere? It looks like cashmere. Look what a pretty color. This is my favorite color for a screen. This looks pretty. Let's see who it is. Oh, it's Cynthia 
Rowley two ply cashmere. Two ply cashmere. It's a small, it's an extra small. Wow, it's so soft and so pretty. The color's gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Oh, look at the shape of it too. It's got this like longer here. Oh, I like that. I might have to try that one on. <laughs> red, I see red. Oh, okay, we have another, like we have a wrap. Oh, like, so this, oh, it's making me itchy. The cashmere, maybe? Oh, is that sparkle sweater? The silver explosion. <laughs> This is a red, a red, simple dress. Fine. This is, I'll probably put this up for like $19 or something like that. It looks like it has a little bit of wear on it, but it's flattering with that um, X in the middle. I see workout gear. Nice. This is a Columbia. I've already made my bunny back on this box already, already. So this is nice. It's a Columbia exercise. It's got cool little pucker at the sleeve. So you've got that nice ruching. Columbia, good brand. Take that. My color, my favorite color again. Another sweater. How many sweaters is that? One, two, three. H&M size medium, awesome. Another sweater. This one's like green heather, soft. So these sweaters, like everything, probably the dresses, the tops. The tops probably, you know, listed from like 22 to 24. I like to sell tops that are like my bread and butter brands for somewhere around 19 to 22. Uh, so that's sort of like my price point. And I feel very confident that um, almost every piece so far that I can definitely um, meet my goal of, of, of making this a good investment. It's, it's looking good. So let's go. We still have more. Okay, stop talking, Michelle. <laughs> I can't wait to look after I do this video. I can't wait to look at it all. Check it all out. Ooh, okay. Somebody likes dryer sheets. Pretty, 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 pretty. Love the pattern. I'm gonna say this is loft. Let me just take a wild guess. No, it's Mac Studio. That's why it's really nice. Look at the bottom of it. Little keyhole back. Awesome, love that. One of my favorite things. I love patterns. Ooh, cozy something. What is this? Cozy, it's got some cool zippers. I don't know what this means. How long does it take Michelle to find the front of the, what the heck? Oh my God, I'm so gun amused. <laughs> Hang on, I'm trying to zipper it. See, there's a zipper. Let's just see, is a zipper a problem? No. All right, so how do we, oh, okay. B-A-C-I Baki. I don't know what that is. This is a super cool sweatshirt. It's got a really awesome zippers down the front on each side. It's so super, super cozy. It's got really great detail. It's got cute pockets. Nice, another really nice classic piece. Classic for the closet. Ooh, flowers, more flowers. Buffalo. Buffalo is a good brand. Check out this cute pattern. Check it out. Isn't that cute? That's cute. It's a little like, what is it? A dress? Or, sorry, I have to get the camera so close. It's either you see me from far away or see you can see me close from So here I am. I love it. Oh, it's a dress, I think, because I see two little... Oh no, this is the front. Looks like it has a little tiny. I may have to put a little stitch there. Cute though. All right, we're halfway through the box. Are you still hanging with me here? 
Art artis, Artisan New York. That's nice. It's another little dress, size small. You know, I'm learning how to get into selling dresses. I haven't really found my niche yet with the dresses. So um, I'm happy that I have some dresses in this box because it'll give me a shot at throwing them up there and seeing how it goes. Oh, who likes bubble gum? I do, I like bubble gum. Oh, BCBG Generation, cute little dress, cute color. Looks like it comes maybe just to the knee. It's got some funky, cool seams on it over here. Oh, I love that. I love that color too. It's so poppy, right? I might have to wear this one. It's a medium too. Oh, I like that. Okay, you guys, I've gotten, I've gotten some, uh, some good stuff so far. How many of you guys have done thread up boxes? Can you? Put some notes down there. Tell me what you think. Have you had amazing ones? Have you had horrible ones? One of my friends said she got four boxes of the shoes and struck it rich with them. Like literally, she said, Michelle, you've got to try out the shoes. But I wanted to try out this again. <gasps> I see something here. Lululemon? Lululemon. Size eight? Oh my gosh, stop it. Jesus, take the wheel. Oh my gosh, look at this. They're so cute. Size eight, black, they're in great shape. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. <laughs> Thank you, thread up. <laughs> that's great. Lululemon, I still love having them in my closet. And every once in a while I find some without a, um, a size tag on them. So I'm saving those and send them to my sister and use them for working out. A little old navy, a purple little skirt. Cute. Another cute, cute skirt. Oh, Mac Studio again, that's nice. This is an extra small. But uh, it looks like it has a little bit more size to it than most of them. I love it. Check out the pattern. Plaid. We like plaid right on. Plaid, animal prints, and polka dots. And birds. Women love anything with birds on it. Birds, birds, birds. Somebody told me that in a YouTube video. And I tried it out. And it works. <laughs> birds. All right. What is this? A gap. True skinny. Gap jeans. Gap jeans. You know, Gap's not the best, you know, most expensive brand, but when you're buying something like this, this box full of 50 pounds of clothes, I mean, I have no problem selling these Gap jeans for, you know, 12 bucks, something like that. I'll take it, you know, I'll take that. I'll take that money. Why not? Okay. This is a skirt, it looks like, and... It's from Forever 21 and it's just a black skirt. Oh, it's not just a black skirt. It's got a slit up the side of it. Go on, girl. Forever 21. Some skirts there. We got skirts today. Skirts today. This is another black basic from Ink, size medium. Oh, it's not. Look, it's got a little peephole. Ooh, those are, this one's sexy when you have like the little peephole here. What size is that? Oh, it's a medium. That I really love. Sometimes it's just like plain black color with like just a little something open, like a keyhole. So sexy. So much sexier than hanging, hanging everything out. That's just my opinion. Oh, here we go, ladies. Oh, oh it's a jacket. No, oh my gosh, you guys, this is really, it's uh, time and true, okay. Look how cute. Look how cute that is, right? See, this piece, it's a perfect example. Look, I've got blue stripes on, okay. This matches, I have like little cute brown organite, but that, that looks so crazy. This looks so crazy in the box.
But when you put it together with something, and it doesn't really necessarily even have to match too much. You know, if you have jeans on, like I have jeans on, it's just something cute to like throw over your basic stuff. Just think of it as like a regular jean jacket. I love it. Let me see if the collar goes up a little bit because sometimes I like to wear the collar up. <gasps> I am so happy so far. I think my favorite thing so far, I really like this jacket. And I think the cashmere sweater is really nice too. Jeans. Let's see. Uh, Abercr Abercrombie and Fitch jeans. So I, something's itching my nose. Sorry, guys. Maybe it's dust? Maybe? I mean, we always wash our clothes after we after we get them over here at my house. Abercrombie and Fitch, 24, nice skinny, skinny jeans. This is another skirt. So I have a few skirts. Joe, I don't know what it is. Very cool pattern. One, again, oh, because here we go, stripes. Love the stripes, love the this pattern, it's super flattering. It draws your eye to the center, makes you look taller and skinnier, which we love, right? And it's nice elastic waist. I've never heard of the brand, but I like it. I don't always have all fancy brands in my closet. Sometimes if I just find something that I like, I'll just, you know, the print or whatever, I'll pick it up because it's fun. I want my closet to be a little bit like me. I mean, I know there's certain things that I have to sell in order to, you know, uh, have my bread and butter, but it's all the fun little things that I love that I can interject into my closet that brings me so much joy when I find other people who like them. It's quirky stuff. I'm a little quirky. Okay, Old Navy. We've got a couple of Old Navy things in here. That's fine. Mm. They're cute. Polka dots. Again, what size are they? They're a bigger size. Oh, I can't even see it, but they're cool. I'm going to keep going. I don't want to lose my range. Lauren Conrad. Extra, extra large. Love it. Strawberry shirt with strawberries on it. Huh. Well... I don't know about this. It looks like it has a little bit of wear on it too. A little wear right there. Mm, I'm not sure about that. I'm gonna put that one over there. I see more black stuff in here. Is this more work? It's more workout stuff. Oh, this is cool. This is a small petite. It's by Champion. Looks like it's a workout top, but it's a. Um, it's a turtleneck and on the back of it, it has a really cool little pattern to it on the back of the neck. It's on the front of the neck actually. Cute, I like that. We're keeping going. What else is this? I think they must've stuck me in the athletic, the Z athletic part of the thing. Old Navy again, Stevie, little green pants. Those actually are in very good condition. I'm gonna blow through here. We still have a lot allotted here. <laughs> Black pants. Black is so hard to photograph. <gasps> if you have any tips about how to photograph black clothing, let me know because I just, every time I get something black now, I, I, I feel like I'm gonna have a panic attack. <laughs> because it takes so long rolling, getting off the fuzz, getting off the hair. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's a bit of a chore. These are nice. These are just jogging pants. Oh, they're not, they're Lululemon. <laughs> Look, oh, wow. These are big, comfy, cozy ones. Okay, this is tricky. There's no size on this. This happens a lot with Lululemon because they have this long tag and sometimes it gets it gets stuck in your um between your bum cheeks <laughs> to be quite honest with you and you just like forget it. We're getting rid of this. Nobody wants that. Ain't nobody want that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Isn't that what they say? Look how great these are. These are great. These um look so comfy they need to be washed they've got fuzzies on them but they're great i had two pairs of lululemons 
two pairs and both of them are amazing sizes. So, so far so good. Here's some more black stuff, Jones, you, New York. It's got some weird tie in the front of it. It's like this, what is that? Looks like, you know what it looks like? <laughs> Okay, we don't know about that one. That one with the uh, something on the front of it. Oh, navy blue. Let's see, navy blue dress. Navy blue dress by Miami, size medium. Oh, it's great. It's got a little V cut in the front of it. And then down at the bottom, it has a little lace detail. Perfect. In the back, it's just simple with a little excellent i love this size medium navy's cute perfect i keep saying cute cute it's cute it's cute it's practical that's a practical dress to go to a party in would look super cute with brown wedge heels i love brown and navy this is a very bright too petite banana republic dress with some oh this must be the little sat this must be the little sash that goes along with it. I love this color. This color is just life. I might have to try this one on. I love punchy colors. That's one thing I learned from being in TV and film and auditioning. Find a couple of colors that look really good on you and buy several pieces because when you walk into a room or you walk, you know, and you and you have a beautiful, like a bold blue, like cobalt blue or this tangerine color, you can see when you put it even up to your face, how it, this color is pretty. It kind of goes with, with my coloring. And that's a good way to find out if it looks good on you. Okay, let's see. This is, it's not Hervé Leger. It might be a knockoff, but really i mean it looks like it's like a knockoff let's see what it is we'll check it out i mean i couldn't get that lucky right oh it's bcbg it's bcbg and it's really cute and speaking of cobalt blue this is the color i was just talking about if you have brown hair and brown eyes even blue eyes but with dark that's gonna sell that sexy is you know what i got more workout gear here athleta i got athleta oh athleta oh my goodness look they've got these cool cutouts on them what size are these a small oh my gosh oh my gosh that i cannot believe i cannot believe it's, it does smell like they put some kind of a, like some, some freshener in there or something like that, but it doesn't smell, I don't like the way it smells. Sorry, thread up. All right, something, what's this, something. Eileen Fisher, very nice. We love Eileen Fisher, such beautiful quality, so simple. This is black with this pretty little, uh, buttons on it that have a sort of a mother of pearl kind of thing happening. I have a Labrador retriever and he's um, in his crate and he's uh, dreaming. So if you hear his feet. He's snoring and he's going like this. It's making a noise. It's so silly. Ooh, I got some more pants. These are Zuda. Zuda extra extra small petite an extra extra small petite girl you're cute you're cute if you wear these let me tell you what zuda they've got cool see this is something since they gave me athleta and they gave me lululemon now they gave me this i've never heard of this brand one of the things i love the most like i said is doing research finding out more about them okay let's see what is this more workout pants J. Jill. They were straight-legged J. Jill pants, the knit ones. I love J. Jill knit. I love Chico's knit. I will sell that whenever I have the opportunity. 
So here's hot pink. This is Lord and Taylor, and it looks like it's a light cardigan, which is actually perfect for the summer. This would be perfect for the summer for, for warm weather. It's nice and light. It's a great size. It doesn't say what size it is, um, but it's a pretty color. Loft! Cute little pink cardigan. All these little things like this, I would probably put up for, I don't know, you know, 18, 18 to 22, maybe. I have to go over all these pieces though, and really make sure that you look at every little spot. Make sure you look under the arms to see if there's any holes. I was just uh, listing something and I noticed that inside uh, the crotch area of the pants, right in the center, there was like two little um, stitches that just were loose. Thank God I had gone through it and, and noticed it when I was photographing the, um, the inseam. But, you know, it happens to me too sometimes. I just, I look over it. I don't, I, it's an, a mistake. I don't see it. So yeah, we're only human. Don't beat yourself up too much. That's one good piece of advice for um, being your new, a new thrifter. Nick and Zoe. Nick and Zoe are cute. We're loving Nick and Zoe. Cute. Size small. Simple little thing, but nice. Oh, I see something fancy in here. You want to see? Let's just, we'll just go like this. I'm going to show you, and then we have to guess who makes it. All right. This looks beautiful. It feels like it's silk. It's got the most flattering black sash under here. Amazing. And the darkness comes down the center. So you look tall. I like to, I want clothes that make me look better. This is beautiful. It's got this gorgeous ruffle at the bottom. I love to do this. <gasps> oh my goodness, you guys, look how feminine and beautiful. Oh my gosh, I love it. I'm gonna say it's probably BCBG who makes it. Yes! <laughs> and it's new with tags. <gasps> it's new with tags from Dillard's, it says. BCBG, it's a zero. It's a zero. It's beautiful. Holy cow, you guys. Anybody going to a wedding? Beautiful. If I say it's beautiful one more time, I know you'll probably be super annoyed, but it's really beautiful. I can't believe my box. I'm so excited. Okay, wait. <laughs> oh my God, I need to photograph all this stuff. Okay, I can't think about that right now. Okay, shorts, BDG. BDG comes from Urban Outfitters. Cute little mini skirt. Mini skirts are super in. Mini micro minis. Awesome. I like to sell just jeans. Anything jeans, shorts, jean shorts, all of it. Okay, let's see. Some more black stuff. That's nice. Turtleneck J. Crew size small, very simple piece. This J. Crew piece will probably will probably go for you know twenty dollars. So I probably listed at like twenty six maybe. I do really well with J. Crew. J. Crew is one of my favorite brands to sell. I um I really do enjoy that loft. Nice little brown top. Oh, it has like a. That's cute. It has this pretty thing. Kind of like what's happening a little with me. <laughs> I see something big and white <clears throat> and fuzzy in there. More black, 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 black. I guess a lot of women wear black. I really like colors, but this is beautiful. And it's Tahari. <sighs> this is like so awesome. It's This box has been such, such a, I, I've made, I, I can't even tell you, you guys between the Lululemon and the Athleta and the BCBG. Oh, another Athleta? You guys, look, it's Athleta. Oh my God, I'm gonna try it on. I'm sorry, I'm not far enough away from you guys. I, I wear like a medium, but oh. Oh my God. Look 
how cute I look with this. I want it. I want everything. <gasps> OMG. Look at how freaking cute this is. Look. Ooh, and let's like zip it up just because I love high necked things. Quick, I gotta stick my hair. <laughs> love it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is just crazy. This is just, this is like, oh my gosh. I feel like I don't even need to go thrifting for a while. Like, and I have such good stuff here, and I still have more. <laughs> There's probably like six more things, guys. All right, so what's this? Let's play that game again where we guess what it is. Okay, this is something, a black dress with some kind of a cutout in the back. It's not, it's trousers. Trouser pants, I think, trousers. Yes, with an open back to it. It's, it's, it's great. It looks, it looks really fun. I actually, I want to try this one on and see what it looks like. Who makes this? Um, I don't know who makes this, but I'll have to look a little bit closer. The tag doesn't say on the tag. Looks like a really pretty tag though. I'll do some investigating and see what I can come up with. Okay. Let's get rid of these black things so I can Zara. These are faux suede pants. They're faux suede. Nice. Navy blue. Rag and bone. I just sold a pair of rag and bone jeans yesterday, actually. These are gray, uh, excuse me, gray. These are navy. And they're a size, they're a size two. They're a little smaller, but Rag and Bone make, uh, makes nice quality items. So, all right, here we go. Black pants, looks like black jeans. Looks like a great size. Melissa McCarthy, I don't know, 16 wide, slim blue. Ooh, 16, awesome. These are really nice. Really nice, cute pocket design on the back. It's not a designer that I've, that I've heard of, but again, I'm gonna, these are cropped, I'm gonna check. Check her out. <laughs> My pile is so big, it's looking, it's bigger than me. Okay, guys, what's next in here? What's this? This is an Avenue, size 18. Beautiful. Looks like a houndstooth sort of check. Pants, dress pants for work. Perfect size. Nice color, classic addition to anybody's closet. These are green. Hmm. These look really cool. These are, they don't feel like they have any. These are Current Elliot. Current Elliot, I've heard of them before. Oh, these are so cool. Look at them, they're drawstring. They look like they're new without the tag because here's a little taggy thing and it's not there. They are skinny at the at the bottom and they're a size two? Really? I'm gonna have, this is, oh my gosh, they're paper. I think they're paper, paper bag pants, but I just have to pull, pull them into the papery baggery part. Okay, I think I'm keeping these. <laughs> these are like the ultimate cozy pants. They feel nice too. I can't believe this. I can't believe this box is so good. I have about four more things left. All right. Okay, this is the final. It's not the final black one. Okay, another black. Michael Tyler, I don't know who that is. It's a nice uh, cardigan. It's got some some cool buttons on it. Looks like it looks like it's got a heart. Looks like it's kind of arts and craftsy. I'll have to investigate that one later. Oh, <gasps> tie dye! 
my favorite. Oh, look at it. this tie-dye sweatshirt. <gasps> it's pastel tie-dyed. It has pocket in the front so you can stick stuff in it. It's a nice big size. Oh, it's airy. It's a large. Wow. The problem with sourcing is that I want to keep everything. I'm not joking. I want to keep it all. Stripes. Are you ready for some stripes? Toss designs. Hmm. Well, we all know that horizontal stripes might not be the most flattering on everyone. I don't know how I feel about this one. Maybe I might donate it. I won't want that. I don't know. I'm not crazy about the designs here. Okay, let's see. What's this? I can't believe I got that athletic jacket. Now, this one feels, um, I can't, I did not see it. I did not. Let's see what it feels like. It feels like a jacket. And it feels like it has that kind of workouty material. Gardier. Gardier. Oh, it's got a, it's got a stain on it. It looks like paint. Huh. It feels nice. Oh, I don't know. It's some kind of jacket. I might have to see if I can get that stain out, but that's not too bad. That's really the only one that's had a stain so far. I have two things left. What is this? It's Land's, uh, Land's End. Oh, it's just like a linen blend, little v-neck, cute, square, tropical. Yes. The woman who wears this would probably wear them with cute little khaki shorts or something like that. I love Land's End. It's just such good quality. I used to model for them all the time. So, I mean, I went everywhere with them. They were such a cool company. Last but not least, Anthropology. They're Anthropology. And they're floral pants they are so cool they are a size mp medium petite i imagine and they're adorable i told you i just love i love patterns i don't know how i just started loving maybe it's because i'm getting older and i'm liking patterns i don't know but i love them so you guys <laughs> my thread up box what do you think what do you guys think i have to say i got athleta i got lululemon i got land's end there was some garnet hill in there i really 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 have to say that i'm very happy and i do believe that this box actually has better stuff in it than my first box and i was really really pleased so i will keep you guys posted on all this stuff it's gonna take me a while to post it but i'm so so happy that you joined me and um if you like content like this thrifting looking at stuff talking um you know please like and subscribe <laughs> and you will see me out garage selling that's what i was doing all weekend long so Take care, guys. Thank you for spending this time with me, checking out my thread up box, and I highly, highly recommend it. Have a great night, and of course, peace out.